shocking new video of the murder of a Kentucky judge caught on tape and shown in court. Judge Kevin Mullins gunned down in his office, office allegedly by his friend, Sheriff Mickey Steins. So we're, we're not going to show you the moment. We've paused it. Well, now the judge in that case has found probable cause to send the case to a grand jury. Kelsey Kernstein joins us now. Kelsey, this is hard to watch even with the video on pause, what's been the reaction to this footage? The reaction, of course, has really been shock, Marky. So some inside the courthouse even crying as this video was played. Now, prosecutors, they say it clearly shows former Sheriff Sean Mickey Steins shooting the judge, Kevin Mullen, several times as he covers his face and tries to hide under his desk. We do really want to warn you here that this video is disturbing. New video allegedly shows the moments leading up to a deadly encounter inside Judge Kevin Mullen's chambers. We see the judge holding out his hands as Sheriff Mickey Steins appears to raise and point his gun at Judge Mullen's. And this is when the shooting begins. We will not show those moments because of the graphic nature. It happened late last month and former Sheriff Steins quit right after his arrest. He's been in jail ever since. In court where the video was played, the only witness called was Kentucky State Police lead investigator Clayton Stamper, who testified that four witnesses heard the shooting in the next room. One person stated that she heard, she didn't recognize him as, as being Judge Mullen's voice, but heard somebody say, help, help. According to Stein's attorneys, the two met for lunch near the courthouse that day. In the video not shown in court, Sheriff Steins uses his cell phone to call his daughter, then uses the judge's phone to call his daughter again before the shooting. Investigators are waiting for data from the phones to determine what relevance it has to the case. Investigators are also looking into a sexual harassment lawsuit against the sheriff's office. So what's happening right now is both cell phones are undergoing forensic testing. Sheriff Steins could face up to 20 years or up to life in prison. Now, this is interesting. According to Kentucky state law, because he's been accused of killing a public official, he could face the death penalty. Now, we also know when he was arrested, he said only this, treat me fair. Marky? Awful for that courtroom to see uh, and his family in that community. Kelsey, yeah. thank you. Thanks for watching, everybody. Go to join in.